Yeah, so when I was at Bangor, um, we studied a few different languages and a few different kind of concepts while we were there, uh, which gives us a good grounding and different things that we could work on. So we were mainly using Java in university, um, but we also touched on some of the languages such as Python and a bit of C. Um, but obviously when you go into, into the workplace, you could be faced with anything and you've always got to use the best tool for the job. There's no point trying to hit a nail in with a, with a um, spade. So you've got to just adapt and use what you've learnt in university and apply it to whatever you need to. So, for example, I started out with Java, but you know I needed to move on to Objective C for, for iPhone, for example. Um, and it's just a case of you have to apply the same concepts to it and then go with that and, and shoot with that. And while I was at Bangor, they, they kind of teach you a lot of the, the sort of core core concepts and core, core understandings and a lot of the lower level stuff. So you're not coming out as a, as a Java developer, for example, but you're coming out as a software developer that really understands what's going on behind those lines of code and why it's a good idea to do this and not a good idea to do that. So, you know, while being at university, you've really got to pick up on those things and learn not a programming language, but learn programming as a whole so you can then adapt to what you want to do later on. Thank you.